Hey everyone, in this video I will show you few solutions to fix the UE4 Atomic Hard Game error. So please follow the steps with me and let's jump into it. First of all, it's better to disable any third party antivirus or Windows security on your computer. Then check for updates manually and if there is any updates available, make sure to download and install them. You also need to make sure your graphic card is up to date. So to find out what graphic cards you have and it needs updating, just go to search and type in their system information. Then expand the component on the side and click on display. Now in here, you should see your graphic card information. So to download the drivers, head over to the official website, then complete the information for your device and click on search. Then at the bottom, you will see the latest versions in here. If you are using AMD or Intel drivers, then you need to follow the same process. I will leave the link in the video description for these websites. The next solution is to go to this website and download these three Visual C++ files. The link will be in the description for you to access this website. So go ahead and just click on them one by one and download them. So once the download is completed, just open it up and run it on your computer. Select this one to agree the license agreement and then click on install. Do the same thing, open up the other two files that you've just downloaded and run them on your computer. And next we need to go to this website to download the DirectX End User Runtime Web Installer. This website's link also will be in the video description. So in here you need to select the language that you want and then click on download. And the next solution is to disable control flow guard in Windows. So to do that, open up your search bar and type in there Windows Security. Open it up. On the left, select App and Browser Control. Then click on Exploit Protection Settings. And in here, on the control flow guard, make sure to select Off by default. You can also do it for each application in Program Settings by following these steps one by one. After you restarted your device, then try to open up the game and run it as administrator. If you're still having a problem, then go to local disk C drive and open users folder. In here, select your username folder. So in my case, this is the folder. And next, open app data. Then local. Over here, look for atomic hard folder and delete it. Hopefully one of these solutions will work for you. So please don't forget to let me know in the comments below. And that's all. By the way, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please consider supporting me and subscribing for more videos. Thanks for watching.